You know who it is, it's DJ Screen 1053 to be our heart radio, chopping it up on Hood Rich Radio with the one and only Fujiano Fujiano is on the line with DJ Screen. What's up, my brother? What's up? What's up? What's going on, man? You know what's happening? Shit. Yeah. Same old, same old, man. Tell us a little bit, you know what I'm saying? If somebody's been under a rock, bro, a little bit about the Fujiano movement, you know what I'm saying? How you got started into the, the music situation, how your buzz came about, and, and, and even just as important, how you hooked up with the homie Gucci. All right, shit. I've been, I've been rapping. I've been rapping for a little minute. I just ain't, I ain't really taking serious. I went to prison. I came home and took a I, mm -hmm. I made a few songs. I ended the showcase. I won the showcase. Mm -hmm. and I just kept pushing. I was a showcase. I just kept pushing, pushing. Then Gucci, I made Madeline Trapper. Did the video and shit. Gucci heard it. The white reached out and said, he want, he want me to be the first one to sign 10, 17. You know, I was with it. Mm -hmm. So shit. Get that in, and now we just rolling. Most definitely, most definitely, most definitely, man. It was crazy uh, before the whole pandemic started. We actually uh, out there on the north side. We got we got booked to book uh, uh, do a party tappers out there on the north side together. But I told them straight up, I was like, I ain't gonna make it. This pandemic kind of weird. But the next day, everybody hit me. Every bartender and everybody was like, Yo, Fujiano got a real movement. Like everybody comes out with you and show you love. Like. Yeah. Tell you like the president of your hood or something like this. So, yeah, yeah. I love yeah, to see yeah. that. I love to see that. Yeah. So where you? I ain't nobody from my hood never did that. You said what now? I'm the only nigga from my hood that ever do something. Ah, that's real. That's real. They gotta make you feel good though, cause you are gonna motivate yeah, the rest yeah. of the hood to get right. Yeah, yeah. Try mm -hmm. to get everybody on track. Yeah, absolutely. So, so let me ask you. Like, obviously, there's a lot of artists. You know, what I'm saying a lot of rappers. Where does Fujiano want to take it, man? And what separates you from the next artist and what makes you unique and what makes you special? I can do everything. You can do everything. Any topic, any, any occasion, whatever you want. You just, I get to you. Yeah. Yeah. I, don't, I can do whatever kind of genre you want to. I mean, I can't, I can't really sing like no guy. Man, R&B singing that nigga, but yeah. I get on that motherfucking horn like Drake. There you go. <laughs> You can get through it. You can make it sound right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, most definitely. Man. Let everybody know, know a little bit about the world of Fujiano. Like, what you into lifestyle-wise if you're not on the road, you know, doing shows or in the studio cooking up music, man. Like, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah you're a there you go. That's it. Really? <laughs> I'm, there. I'm really, like, I keep, I keep my head out of there trying to be... Bigger than now, nah, you know, all that extra ass shit can feed me. I just, I just take care of my life, take care of my people. You feel me? I like watch stand. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm good. I'm very good where I'm from. It's the world, really. That's why, that why they call me the mayor because I'm good anywhere I go. Like, yeah. in, even even before this shit, it be art nigga hood. I used to go to them nigga hood. Them they ain't gonna take me. You feel me? Like, well, yo, I, I just always been a cool nigga. Oh, your partner's ops. Anybody, my op or they op. Nigga ain't gonna wow. take me. Nigga, 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 nigga. That's respect. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't never, like, I got jumped on in prison, but I was, you know, in prison, nigga, don't give a damn. But on the street, mm. nigga, I ain't never did no crazy shit like that. You could die. Mm. Kill everybody. Mm. Mm. It because, I'm one that, of them that, niggas. That's respect on some positive energy is just respect on people yeah. just respect you. That just mean you solid. I ain't gonna never start shit, though. Mm. Never. You never start nothing from nobody. Nigga, it, it gonna take a lot for you to even make me get on your ass. You feel Like, I, I know how to let shit be. You ain't gonna disrespect me at all, but like just little petty shit, I let that shit be. Yeah. I don't, I don't that shit. Most definitely. So gun I ain't let a nigga take me out of the street. That's that's important, man. I tell people that's the most important thing when you start really getting to the money. It's gonna be so many people that wanna distract you from that pot of gold. You dig what I'm saying? So you gotta stay mm -hmm. focused on, you know, your blessing from above. Like stay focused on that. That's the most mm -hmm. important thing. And you know you a father. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they need crackers ain't playing with your head. They gonna hide you. Man, what uh, Gutter Baby, man? You know what I'm saying? Tell us why. Obviously, the name of the project is Gutter Baby, and uh, and tell us why this is, you know, what I'm saying special to you and, and a unique piece of work for you. All right, we call me and we call ourselves Gutter Gang. So you feel me? Like that been my whole little thing since I started. Gutter Baby. I had I had a couple of, like some, some mixtapes, but I I took all of them down because I want to start them fresh. Start mm -hmm. from one. Gutter did the real. One. You feel me? All the shit was just me learning. Mm. They me. I know I know what's going on now. I ain't learning shit. Mm -hmm. You feel me? So I just felt like 
I feel like she. I don't know. I'm sorry, gonna tell you who I am. That was that album for. You know, so I wasn't trying. I wasn't. My expectation went about number one. You know, some nigga hope the number one nigga nigga work for, it, but mm-hmm. my expectation just let the world know who the fuck I am, and mm-hmm. that what they did. And let them know who I am and how I'm coming. Now the next CD, yeah, I, they they need to be scared. Mm-hmm. What's the mm-hmm. best part of the rap game, bro, for you? you the that. best part, yeah. the money. The money. Yeah, that's it. Correct. That's answer. the only reason I do it. Correct answer. And I and I'm gonna, I'm gonna help you answer too. The fans, I'm yeah, sure you appreciate your fans. Yeah, oh, I love yeah. my fans. Because without the fans, you know what I mean, you, they, they help you get the money. They help me get the money, yeah, you're right. I love my fans. My fans, I got real fans. You do? That would be so, that would be crazy. We're supposed to be dead still. Like, you say yeah. something about me on that, we're supposed to ready to do something to you. Yeah, no, nah, it's a movement. It definitely is a movement. Definitely a movement, man. Definitely a movement. Uh, paint a picture of how your 2021 looks for Scream and for the world and for everybody tuned in. Like, how does your 2021 look? Is it hot? Real hot. Real hot. I like that. Real hot. Man. It gonna be straight gas up. Hmm. I ain't stopping. I ain't stopped during the pandemic. I definitely ain't stopping next year. I know, I know, I know you still, yeah, you still been killing the clubs, you know what I'm saying? But I know you might probably be looking forward to like an actual real like tour where you can just go really go crazy, you know? That's what I'm, that's what I'm looking forward to. Once that tour, once I do that, they're gonna stamp it. Well, mm. niggas, niggas can't be feeling like me. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Niggas ain't, niggas ain't putting on no show like me. That's why I get booked so much shit. Mm. Cause I'm put on the show. And I'm putting on that money, man, for that cheese. I, who gonna deliver for that cheese? There you that's go. What I be sleep, I be dead sleep on. So pull up to the club, wake up, dead yeah. enough. Me oh, kill, kill them folks, then go back to sleep when I get back on this room. <laughs> I'm gonna wake up by that money, man. Amen. It's time to work. <laughs> We're going crazy. Then we going back oh, to sleep. God. And I'm going back to bed. Going back to sleep. <laughs> Wake me up when we get home so I can stash the money. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. Wake me up when home. I feel <laughs> Hey, man, it's important. I, I try to do this with certain artists. Obviously, you got a massive fan base, but you want to continue to grow that. So if somebody's not a Fujiano fan right now and they're about to go listen to this gutter baby, tell them the first song they could listen to and you promise they're going to be locked in. They're going to be a fan. It depends on who they – it depends on how they live. Mm. He, a, he a straight street gangster trap ass nigga. Mm. He, got a, he got a couple of choices. He got Menace. He got First Day in L.A. Mm. He got Cautious. He got goddamn – he got the like, caution. He got made it. He got intro. Mm. If you more of a, if you more of a mellow nigga, you like to just smoke it. I got got them demon. I got chosen. I got star. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Got them. That why that why I tell you, that why I feel like niggas can't fuck with me. Cause what about the ladies? Though? What about the ladies? What if you trying to get the ladies a lot? I got on the, oh, I got that back end on that for them ladies. They every woman I, right now they going crazy. They that overtime. Yeah. Back, they don't know why overtime back end. Them the two every woman. Them folks that DM me to death about them songs. Mm. Yeah. Got that turn that bitch on neck neck little peas I get come over here. Turn on that back end. <laughs> you gonna have some more kids to take care of now. Slow down. Hell nah. Hell nah. <laughs> you gonna have some more to take care of now. Slow down, fool. <laughs> hey, another thing I, I like to do, man. You know, what I'm saying obviously, you know, when you when you when you make it from the streets, I tell people you make it from the hood, and you're able to do something positive. You know, what I'm saying you're able to feed the people around you, man. Give some game of motivation for the people that might be in a not so good mind space. They might still be out there really thugging, and they might not see no light at the end of the tunnel. Say something real to them. Whatever. I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell, you, I'm gonna tell the nigga this. See, I really like telling the nigga. They go, oh, I done heard so many niggas say that. Me, do what I do. Do what I did to all, all the young niggas that hit me up. I do that all the time. I tell them, shit, pull up, pull up on me. I'm just gonna take you, I'm gonna take you to my hood. Mm-hmm. You feel me? I'm gonna take you to my hood. I'm gonna show you what's there. And we're gonna sit there, we're gonna be there all day. I'm gonna show you what we used to do all day. Mm-hmm. And, and and then you're gonna go from coming to my house, seeing seeing me now to where we were. And then you tell me, I did not see nothing, then you tell me. Because this is how the OGs is in my hood to all my partners. Ain't no pity for you. Cause you and Fool just in the same spot. We just watch, we just, and then this thing about it, y'all had more than Fool. Mm-hmm. Fool was the one at the bottom bottom. So so for him to got there, we got no remote for y'all, nigga. Y'all need to get on the grind, do something, get some money, man. 
Mm-hmm. You feel me? That's how I be telling like. That's how I feel about it. I was the lowest out of the crew. Bro, for me to, for me to, for me to. That's how it be though. That's how it be. That's how it be. No excuses because you was the one that made up your mind that it, shit can't stay like this. It's nothing I can do either. I'm a, this, this how it was for me. It yeah. was either. I told my, I swear to God, like two weeks before the shit happened, I told my mom, I said, Mama, either I'm finna die, go to chain gang, or I'm finna blow up. And one of them. Mm. I said, one of them, cause she, all, I, nine people died. Nine of my people died in one year. Got down. Nigga couldn't get down. I, I was trying. I ain't never had a job. I was trying to get a job. I couldn't get a job. Nigga trapping like a motherfucker. Kept fucking bomb up. I told him probably like, bro, it got to be just meant for a nigga do that music. But that was God telling me. Like, let that shit be. That might be telling my partner, like, y'all nigga, do what y'all think. Y'all, y'all nigga think you got to be a traveler. You ain't no traveler. I get my deal. I can come give y'all nigga 50 bad. Y'all fuck it up, but you a traveler. Mm-hmm. How you fuck up 50 bad? Nigga, you ain't no traveler. Do something that you, do something, y'all tell them, do something that you can do. Go you, get a truck. You get deeper than this traveler. Like, like, if you get some money, and you can't make more money with the money. You ain't a hustler. You ain't a hustler. That, 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 that the whole thing about you got to be a hustler. That's what I tell nigga. It's way, you know what I mean? The more hustle, since I got money, it's different though, because I see it now. Since I got money, I see so many ways to make money. And I tell them, like, I don't know how easy it is to make money now. And then y'all got a partner that got all this goddamn money. I'm gonna help you make money by any means. Mm-hmm. As long as it ain't no shit that I know gonna get you away. And I'm gonna have to take care of you. And I ain't been do nothing to help you go to Shanghai and then have to take care of you in ain't That ain't me. Mm-hmm. And I don't give a damn how you feel. I can fight, shoot, whatever you wanna do. Mm-hmm. You know it. Now I tell my people, yeah, but they know. See, we get up. What you gonna do? You gonna beat me? Let's go. Mm-hmm. But you gonna pull your fire? I pull mine out. We mm-hmm. do whatever you wanna do. You don't give a fuck about nothing. Else. Mm. I'm just trying. I ain't gonna never tell you nothing to, 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 to make it go down. That's why I tell niggas, y'all niggas think I don't want to see y'all with no money? Because if I don't see y'all with no money, I got to keep getting your money. Damn yeah. I want you to have your own shit. You can leave me alone. Think I want y'all driving out my goddamn car? You don't drive your own, get your own car. Yeah. That's what I want. I'm trying to put you in position to get your own shit. Well, you ain't got a car at me. Everybody bosses. Man, listen, I want everybody running motherfuckers. When I, when I say, hey, I want a big car, you be like, bro, give me 10 million. Like, mm-hmm. You see, that's what I want to be. I tell, when I can do that, I, I feel satisfied. Because we ain't have shit. We just put dollars together to go get blunt. And, and, and is, is that the mentality? <laughs> you know, I've been around a long time. Like, you know, that's what it is. That come from, because why I ain't going? Why, man, if, you ain't, if you ain't talking about getting no money, right, why, you ain't hanging around. Why, you ain't talking. Yeah, you ain't nothing about it. You ain't come around. Yeah. Give a fuck. Fool, that nigga ain't want that nigga want no money. He just want to kick around. He got want to be a shooter all that. Send that nigga at home. Mm-hmm. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't fucking with that. We've been paying it. Mm-hmm. See, there's, there's another thing what I be telling nigga. I shoot, I shoot. So I don't all that. I do this nephew. So I do that for me. Mm-hmm. Can't nobody protect me like me. You feel what I'm saying? That's how I feel about it. So anything I do out my heart, I'm doing it because I love you. Mm-hmm. Let me ask you one question before you slide. I know you got a lot, you know what I'm saying, to get to, but how, how you know. I, I, I ain't gonna lie, like, bro, I be praying for rappers and street rappers because it's crazy out here. Some of my personal homies ain't here no more, right? Um, how do you manage, you know, your mindset and how you move to stay safe out here because it's just been crazy. This I, only hang, I only hang with mine. You only hang with yours. I only hang with mine. I ain't, the only time you'll catch me with anybody that ain't grow up with me is in a studio. Oh, yeah, the club Man, what, if you, what if you just out and about? Because we've been seeing it pop off at the mall. It's popping off at the jewelry store. It's popping off. Get what I do. Get what I do to niggas when I see them out. Speak to them. Man, and my boy going to walk off. Because I ain't going to be by myself. Not in no bar, no shit like that. Going to speak to you and walk off. Because cause this thing, this how nigga feel. Like a nigga feel like, just come in, you did a song. Your smoke, my smoke. What the fuck? Just because you, you did a song and, and you don't like this nigga, I don't pro fuck with him. I don't even know you like that nigga. We did a song. I might fuck with that nigga. Just did the verse with you. Mm-hmm. You feel me? Like, it be shit like that. And then niggas don't really be like that. Like, all that raw, raw shit, how they be rapping. They just ain't like that. Since I got in this shit, I see this nigga be bitch. Them niggas ain't, them niggas be ho. Then they be, they, they, they listen to other nigga music and, and people, other nigga got going on and see it. Like, oh, that nigga, like, he really stepped. Him, he young nigga really like that. So I'm gonna try to link up with him. What's new? I ain't kicking it. I don't want no talk to you. I don't want to kick it by myself. Mm. I got plenty of home. I definitely don't need no more homeboys. I got too many. There you go. <laughs> you got another Lazarus of life. I swear to God, and they life. I got so many yeah, problems, right. man. Right. Oh God, I got, please. Yes. Man, that's how we move. When we move around at least 15 or uh-huh. And these, these, they, like, this ain't no, oh, this a new nigga. They, they won. They just how we, see, where we from? We ain't got a Walmart, bro. Mm. And we ain't got a Walmart. That's what I'm telling you. Like where I come from, ain't, 
That's why it's so serious to every, my people. Like, we got a meeting that we got a real famous nigga down here. Like, we ain't got a wall, but we got one high school. Mm -hmm. Everybody know everybody. You feel me? That how that shit, that we start together. So that's why other people don't know that. Like, we are, that we ain't know that much sticking together. It's fucking shit. We in this, we, okay, yo, that what I just tell nigga from out here. We ain't got no damn ops down here. It's not an op. That man stay five minutes down here. Know everybody. I know where that man mama stay. Yeah, everybody. Know, right. How can he be an op? That man ain't yeah. no damn op. That man just, we just don't like them. That's not an op. An op is when shit dying. When, when, when shit, when shit seared, like, when you see that man, that shit on. Like, that fine shit, see, that's where we come from. That's why I be telling niggas. We, you know what I'm saying? We, we ain't getting to that shoe shit, so we got over in, like, like, middle school, like, 16, 17, shit like that. We beating each other ass. We beat your ass. You know what I'm saying? Like, that we come from. Oh. I be, that's why I be telling niggas, like, the rap nigga, I beat your ass all day, every day. I'm my mama. Any one of them nigga, I tell your ass up bad. Mm. But you know, when it comes to that pistol play, we bought that. But I can put that pistol down mm. if if you if need be. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But niggas ain't niggas ain't built like that. These niggas be like it's a lot of niggas I used to listen to. Met them niggas. Oh my god, them niggas. Well, one nigga I ain't gonna say that nigga ran. Man, I couldn't believe this shit. I ain't never listened to another bar he said. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that bitch come on in my car and turn that bitch so fast, I just can't do it, man. Oh, man. Oh, that bar, oh, that raw, raw. Like, see, this is how I feel. I respect a nigga way more. Like, a nigga like J. Cole, them nigga that don't be talking about that raw, raw shit. Yeah. But they they rich as hell from, from rapping they life. You mm feel -hmm. me? And y'all niggas want to talk about shit that a nigga really had to go through. Like, I really had lived it. I had to. This ain't, I ain't chew to. I ain't want to. I ain't, that ain't cool. That shit ain't cool what we had to do. That's why we said nigga like, but y'all nigga rap about this shit like that shit that that shit gets you some cool point. Your bitch had, but when it's time to live, like, look at sick nine. That that be the example. I got all my partners. Man, mm -hmm. listen, man, you gonna be a sick nine? Don't hang around me, man. I don't wanna kick it with you. Right. Real. You rap about rap about some rap about fucking bitches. Cause I promise you, get what? It, man, you rap about some fucking some bitches. It niggas that listen to that shit all day. It niggas out here that don't wanna do nothing but fuck. Oh, you don't care about getting no money. He work a day to day job, and his day to day job consists of getting going to work and getting all fucking with some bitches. Yeah, some people just in hip hop for the fashion. You know what I'm saying? Oh, my life, bro. That's yeah. why I be telling them. Y'all yeah. just got to find a good goddamn fan base. When you find a fan base that like you for what you do, you good. Mm -hmm. Most definitely, man. Hey, I appreciate the conversation, man. We're going to link up further, man, of course, and do some more things, man. Gutter Baby out now. Y'all go stream yeah, that. Yeah, you already know, know. man. Three Rich Radio certified, man. Be safe out there, bro. Salute. I appreciate it. I already know, Z. Thank you. Right. One.